face your ah! face what face what face your ah! face what face what face your ah! You know, it was August the 26th, 2001, when I set out on a journey. A journey to be a professional wrestler. I'm speaking directly to you, Spud. In eight years, I have been rejected. I have been overlooked and misused. But after eight years, on April the 3rd, 2010, it all changes. Do you understand me? I know what you was doing at Spud. You tried to piss me off. I'm not stupid, Spud. You were expecting me to go on a rampage of some sort so you could get the upper hand. It's not gonna happen, Spud, because the fact of the matter is the moment that you smashed me in the skull with that title was the moment that you changed everything. It was the moment that Johnny Thick could finally see clearer. After eight years, I could see what this really, really means to me. Do you understand what I'm saying, Spud? The moment you hit me in the head with that title, everything changed. Eight years, I have put up with frustration. Everything that I have done has revolved around wrestling, everything. The way I eat, the way I train, the way I think, the way I breathe, everything is about wrestling. Yet I have been the one who has been overlooked. I have been the one who's been pushed to the side. And people like you, Spud, people who cheat, people who are not worthy of holding titles, get the push, and I'm sick and tired of it. I have sacrificed too much for this business. Everyone seems to be throwing a blind eye to it, and I'm sick and tired of it, Spud. April the 3rd, 2010, is going to be a new era. Do you understand me? I am sick and tired of people who are not as good as me. The fact of the matter is, I am the best performer this country has ever seen. I truly believe that. And finally, the Morgan fans believe that. They're the only people who's got behind me. After eight years, I finally have support. Because in my entire life, I've done everything on my own. I have not kissed anybody's ass. Everything I've done, I've done on my own. But finally, I'm starting to build some momentum, some respect. At last year's war on the shore, Spud, I made a statement. I saved this company. Have you forgot that? Greg Lambert, have you forgot that? I saved this company and I won back my reinstatement. I beat two other men. I said I would. I defeated Deadly Serious in a two-on-one handicap match. Then I entered myself into the 2010 Gold Rush. I said I would win and I did. I won. I've done everything that I said I was going to do. And on April the 3rd, Spud, at the Carlton, I'm going to keep my promise. Because everything I've said I'm going to do, I have done. Because I deserve it. The Morecambe fans deserve it. And you deserve everything that is coming to you. The moment you hit me in the head with that title, Spud, you changed everything. You changed the way I think. You changed the way I view you as a person. You see, I didn't give a damn about anyone. But now, now I have respect for the fans. They respect me, but you respect nobody. So I'm not gonna give you the time of day. Spud, you don't deserve nothing. I'm a better performer than you. I'm sick and tired of people like you getting the push, whereas I get thrown to the side like a piece of garbage. I'm better than that. On April the 3rd, Spud, I'm gonna make you pay. I'm gonna make you pay for what you've done to Sam Slam. I'm gonna make you pay for what you've done to the Markham fans. I'm gonna make you pay because you're a bad person. It's as simple as that. You think that hitting me in the head, that all of a sudden because the fans cheer me, I'm suddenly a nice guy. I have never been a nice guy. The fans are behind me because they respect the way I perform. They, they respect the fact that I give 1000%. No other wrestler gives more than me, nobody. Because I believe in what I do. This is everything to me. To understand, Spud, this is everything. At war on the shore, you will pay. I don't care about your pathetic team rock star. Because the fact of the matter is, Spud, you think that you're a rock star, whereas I am a psychotic warrior. 
At war on the shore, you are going to get what's coming to you, and I'm going to get what's coming to me. I deserve everything I get. And on April the 3rd, Spud, you are looking at the next XWA heavyweight champion, because I deserve it. I've sacrificed too much. Eight years has been too long for this. This is just another step in the ladder, but this will be the biggest statement that I've ever made in British wrestling. It's time a real champion took over. A champion of my caliber. Because I look like a champion, I act like a champion, I am a champion! A war on the shore spot! You will ultimately face your fear!